God, I hate that. Anyway, what's up, YouTube? It's your Lawrence Aver, King D353. Have you had an error? So let's play Pokemon Glaze. In the last episode, we did the Endurance Challenge. In this episode, we explore the town and then do, um... Go to a forest, I think it was? I'm head of the Ernest Works as a firefighter in this, in this spare time. If anyone knows the deadly power of fire, it's him. Oh, I hear that Ernest Works. I forgot how to read. Espeon evolves from Eevee during the day, while Umbreon evolves to e uh, from Eevee during the night. Of the seven evolutions this far, I think those two are the hardest to get. They aren't. That reminds me, I have to check to see if my um, level stone will actually evolve Magnemite. You're not level stone, trade stone. Where the fuck's the trade stone? There it is. Huh. Maybe if I find Maggie's item, I can use a trade stone on it. I was hoping to see Jota from here, but it's just too far away. That's the endurance challenge. Come on, Tentacle, you can catch me. Whee! But it caught me. Hey kid, do I have a good trade for you? I have a Ninetales that I got from Unova. Wanna trade a Curlia for my Ninetales? I would make that trade if I had a Curlia. Aw, oh, you're missing out. I'll have to check my PC see if I have a Curlia. Me and my father love living here, just because it's such a quaint little town. We're really travelers from afar, though. Have you tried the battle building yet? It's a nice way to train if you need to. You can actually catch your own leafy on Espa Forest clearing. I wonder where they came from. Oh, cool. I technically have no intention of having a backup team, but I think I might do that anyway. Self, Silver League City Gym, Leader Ernest, the guy with good firepower. Door is locked. So I have to have water Pokemon for him, which I do. Espo Forest is teeming with psychic types. I wonder where they all come from. Take a closer look at the world map. Okay, so. Wait. Espo Clearing. Palm Tree Park, Palm Tree Resort. Sunshore Beach, not Sarkin. This is the wrong way, but it seems like I can actually lead somewhere. Espo Forest is really creepy. I'm not leaving sight of the Southerly City again anytime soon. So wait, that's supposed to be that way if I was to the right, not to the left? The Southerly City Airport was built fairly recently to allow travel to far-off regions. So I guess they actually did remake Johto. I was going to be a flight attendant here, but it turns out the only planes they use are biplanes. I'm sorry, only people with a ticket can fly to Johto. So yeah, Johto's also in this game. Flying is an extremely fast way to travel, but it's really scary too. Planes from all over the world make stops here. If there's a region you want to visit, you can get a flight to it here. Hi, scientist. How do the planes fly? The curved shape of the wing causes the air to separate. This causes a sort of suction action, keeping the plane up. Neat, huh? Indeed. We have a plane on the runway at all times, just to make absolutely sure anyone who needs to fly can fly. That's our guarantee. We have a plane on the runway at all times, just to make... Uh, uh, okay. So that was useless. Alright, so I misunderstood. The forest is actually this way. Do I need to restock on items? I have one max revive, five hyper potions, one revive, three lemonades. And I do have quite a few healing items, but wouldn't hurt to get another set. Welcome, how may I serve you? 
Sure, healing items aren't that great. one at the moment are a lot of Brock and Maggie, so we're gonna switch Maggie to the front. Because of those three, she has the worst moveset. Go, Goldeen! <gasps> it's a magic card. I don't have many balls, so I can't waste one on you. I mean, yeah, I can buy them, but why waste money on balls? Wait, I already switched my weak stuff on up front. Let me hone my psychic powers on you! Uh, stay away from my body. As for Haley, would like to battle. Jabra. Tell me, Kadabra, how bright is my future? You are going to die alone. Damn it. I can just imagine that Kadabra seeing its own future just going. Fuck. Funny thing is, you're still going to die. See, Kadabra didn't foresee an attack. Kadabra foresaw my victory. I couldn't make you lose. Well, of course you couldn't. My powers are amplified here. Okay. Esper Grady would like to battle. Esper Grady sent out Petal Waifu. Die, Petal Waifu. Oh wait, you're a guy. Bye, Hideyoshi. We don't take kindly to traps around this part. I would change to Awada, but Awada doesn't fight the tank all that well, so I'll keep Maggie in. Oh no! Ow! That hurt so much. I don't think I can stand the pain. Oh god, why? Beldum. Wait, I was supposed to use Thunderbolt. Why did I Sonic Boom? Ouch! My face! Or lack thereof. Do three eyeballs count as a face? Are you a psychic too? Yes. I foresee me beating this game and never becoming YouTube famous. Sad face. Okay, Iwata, you can actually battle, but Brock, you're as good as fuck, so let's give you the EXP share while we're in the forest. Because I want to keep everyone's levels even. It's how I do. There you go, buddy. Yes, I want to switch the items. He doesn't need berries, he won't be fighting. You weren't looking at me! I can sense it! You want to battle! No, I don't! That's why I tried avoiding you! 
Actually, no, I didn't. I would have walked over to him anyway. But I just had a feeling since he's quote unquote psychic, he would just turn around. And I was right! I'm going to lock these murder codes. Oh god! He actually knows what he's doing! Ouch! Alright, Brock, here's your chance. myself losing. I did. For those of you wondering how doing that to my, um, Awada saved me editing, now I don't have to go back to the Pokemon Center. No. Use. Remember, kids, if you get beaten to all hell, just eat two berries. You'll be fine. Oh my god, a Beldum. This would be an awesome Pokemon, but I don't care. Oh god, no! You will battle me. Is her Pokemon Hypno? Is she being controlled by a Hypno? Okay, I thought she was being controlled by a Hypno. That would have been some creepy shit. Come at me, Slow King. I ain't afraid of you. Okay, I am a little bit afraid of you. Just a little bit. Okay, I should run for that. Yeah! Get wrecked. Who is the king now? Did my mind control work? No. If anything, I think you mind controlled yourself. Stop looking at the goddamn tank. Alright, this is clearly the right way, so I think I missed something over here. Yep, I missed an item. You are not a psychic type! Oh yeah, one of the Pokemon I caught in the Safari Zone was a Mawile. I named him Barbie. Yes, I said him. Sadly, I do not have any, um, I don't have any walls on my team. I mean, technically I could build Susie to be a wall, but I'm not going to. We need to build a wall. I don't know why I said that. I'm running out of material, guys. Help me. Quick, find someone to teach me how to be funny. 
Now I think about it, I should probably stop talking when I encounter wild animals. If I'm giving myself excuses not to edit them out, and I probably should be editing them out. Oh, it's you, King. Come here, I want to tell you something. Okay. This shrine was built long ago in order to provide offerings to Mew. Oh, I assumed it would be Celebi. Who was believed to live here. It's so relaxing and peaceful here. If I were Mew, I'd live here too. Earlier today, I challenged the previous champion, Gray, and defeated him, which means I'm the new champion. Now that I'm champion, I have more duties than ever before. I'm worried I won't be able to deal with trouble like Team Fusion anymore. Did you feel that? It's happening again, isn't it? And back to the real world. Blake! King, it's good to see you again. You act like you expected us. The odds you'd meet us here in two different places are incredibly large. It's, well, as far as I can tell, I can feel disturbances in the fabric of space and time. Anyone can, really, if you focus enough. But I have to tell you something important. I was doing research about anything that could link to the Pokemon world with this one, and I stumbled on something about 50 years ago. A newspaper article I was printed about. No! The portal's about to suck you back! The article said that pi a pink... That a pink. So, it has something to do with Mew, then. There's no time to lose. We can't wait for you to get your seventh badge. We have to go to the Temporal Tower now. I have a hunch we'll find what we need there. But first... I'm concerned. Should I have gotten Ultra Balls? Am I about to capture a legend? I'm sorry to drag you into this again, but two people can do the work of one much easier. Honchcrow, you fly! Hmm, seems quiet, but I better check. Ow. It's you! Damn it, how do you keep finding us? Am I doomed to have my wounds ripped open every single beeping day? It's time to crush you for good! Wait, did my translator censor Pikachu? Yeah, this battle isn't happening. Nice attempt. Goodbye. I'd love to capture you, but you seem to be my rival. Three, three, two, 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 two. Well, crap. I got beat again by the freaking kid who kicked me out of my home. How is that fair? That's right, it isn't. I'm going to tell the rest of Team Fusion that you have arrived. That's not fair either, is it? Too bad. Ha ha ha! See you never. Okay, seriously, how the fuck is that thing part of Team Fusion? Also, you don't need to- You don't need to the share anymore, so... We'll give you back a citrus berry. And I'll keep Iwata in front, because he's now my weakest team member. Actually, how much time has passed since the start of this episode? I wasn't really keeping track. You know what? In the next episode, we take on all of Team Fusion. I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. This is YouTube.